Hi everyone, my name is Heidi and thank you for watching this video. Today I am going to my first day of Japanese university. I have my Japanese class today and I'm so excited because I've been struggling for an entire week trying to make it. I don't know how I made it this far, but I'm excited to finally learn something. I'm so, so desperate. <laughs> um, this class is five credits, which means it's gonna be hard. That is more than my financial accounting class, which I think is the highest credit course in like the college of business so i'm gonna need this a so i'm gonna go ahead and get ready for that i have like a different feeling like i'm not nervous i'm more excited and i've never had this feeling before for like a class so hopefully it's great i'll let you know how it was after <laughs> but for now i'm gonna go ahead and get ready so oh here's my outfit so i'm wearing i'm wearing a uh, just like a, a white, uh, what's it called? Bodysuit. And then my plaid pants. And then eh, my white heels. Shout out to Allison because your girl hooked her up. She's the one that literally inspired me to be a little bit more fashionable. And then also everyone else in Japan. Like, everyone is so fashionable. I don't want to look like a loser. So I'm, you know, trying to keep up. I have not used this backpack in so long, but I have a binder in here with some paper, which I don't think I'll need because I'm going to use that for my other classes. But for this class, I specifically bought its own, uh, I usually don't do this, but I bought its own notebook just because I know there's going to be lots of like, just <laughs> lots of writing and stuff. And then I guess I'll bring some flashcards, you know, put some vocab, and then my very expensive and beautiful ballpoint pen. But I don't know how like the vibes, you know what the vibes are. You know, some classes, like you just go through the syllabus and other times you go through the syllabus in five minutes and then like the next night is like chapter one <laughs> discussing the world's economy so i'm just gonna be ready to really study today because we in japan they different so i'm gonna go ahead and go to the convenience store because they have bomb breakfast like to go so i'll grab that probably buy some more water and then I'm gonna head over to campus. It's on a different campus. Um, I'm on Gotenyama right now, and I have to go to Nakamiya, which is about like a 10, 15 minute walk. And it is kind of gloomy today, which kind of sucks. So I need to like bring my umbrella and hopefully it doesn't rain on my hair. And then also I have to go back to Osaka because I forgot my tripod, like my little camera stand and my gloves. My hands do get really cold. All right, enough of elaborating. Um, let's head out.
literally cannot vlog and walk and hooks and ball at the same time without my tripod. <laughs> but I made it to campus. It's gloomy and a little sad looking, but I'm so excited. <laughs> I'm on my way to class. I'm probably gonna eat my breakfast because I'm early. Um, but better, way better to be early than to be late because they don't tolerate tardiness at all in Japan. Um, so if you're more than 10 minutes late, you probably shouldn't even show up to class because you're absent already. But I'm here. So I am doing homework because, you know, first day of class, but it's Japanese, so they give you homework the first day. And it's due tomorrow, so I have this class three times a week, Monday, Tuesday, and Friday at different times, which is kind of weird. But I literally feel like I'm in kindergarten again, like, <laughs> it's so cute. Look at that. Um, but. I know it's gonna get really hard like it's not even that easy now like it looks like it is but she introduced a lot of vocab that we need to learn in today and then tomorrow it looks like we're doing like introduction the writing system greetings and numbers if it wants to focus there we go um so we got lots going on um, but for anyone at home who wants to maybe learn Japanese, I, I heard that Genki was a pretty good book and a lot of people start with this. But I'm really excited because I finally get to learn Japanese. Um, my class was pretty great. I had about like 10 people I think. It was a really small class. So I feel like I'll be very, very interactive. Um, so there's like no way I can't learn Japanese. So yeah so that was my first day of school it was a pretty awesome day i did have only one class so tomorrow i have three classes i'll have my international economics class and documenting japan film and photography so i'm really excited about that class and yeah i will catch up with you guys later um like this video make sure to comment and um, don't forget to subscribe all right thanks for watching guys bye wait Yeah, so you're not out. Bye.